All right, welcome back, guys. So let's look at the next component. So um, we last saw the grid component. So we are coming to the end of the components that we can use to build pages. So we have the colors component here. So we've actually seen this before. And basically, these are the default colors that come with Ionic. So primary, secondary, tertiary, success, warning, danger, dark, medium, and light. So you can use any of these colors by just changing the color name. So um, well, we've already seen how to use this, but let's just do one more. So I can go ahead and copy this attribute. I'll copy it and I'm just going to change the color of maybe the first icon. So I would reduce that. And you see this is, let me just go to the icon. So this is the first um, ion item here that says home. It's actually an ion column that says home so that's what we have here and then above it we have the icon so ion icon and the name is home the color is danger so I can actually change this color to primary for example and save and let's see what happens you see voila it has changed to a uh, color primary which is which is this guy we have here so any of the colors you see here that you want to use on your app all you just need to do is to change the name so warning danger dark and stuff like that okay so but the question is what if you wanted to like use another color like purple for example or you know some other color um orange you know so in the next lecture i'm going to show you how you can actually um, create your own color variable okay it's a little bit a little bit techy but it's actually straightforward okay so if you just you know take some time and look at what i'm doing you'll be able to create your own color variables i'll do that in the next video all right see you there